Hey, we're Patricia and Matt. And this is our first YouTube video. And today marks the first day in our year of travel. And we just packed up everything we have into a carry-on suitcase and an Osprey 40 liter backpack. Which is not much space. So stick along to see how that goes. But we just recently quit our nine to five jobs. We packed up and moved out of our first apartment and you're gonna be on the journey with us to learn how to talk to a camera and, <laughs> and, and vlog in public. Um, but we're very excited. We've been doing a lot of research and planning. It's taken about a year of planning. We've learned the ins and outs of travel credit card hacking. We've gotten all of our travel vaccines in order. We sold a lot of our possessions, including both of our cars. So all we have is what we're carrying and a few items that our parents kindly let us store at their houses. And so we're currently driving down to the Miami International Airport. We're from Orlando, Florida, but uh, we decided to fly Turkish Airlines to our first destination, which is? Which is Bali. Bali, Indonesia. So we'll be flying Turkish Airlines from Miami International Airport with a layover in Istanbul, Turkey. And then we'll finally be in Bali, Indonesia in, in about two days. In over 35 hours of 35 travel. 35 hours. We're super excited to become full-time travelers and we're excited to discover what all that entails and how life on the road really is like. Yeah, we kind of just can't believe that it's actually real at this point. The day has finally come. We said goodbye to all of our friends and family, which was a bittersweet moment. So I guess that's all we have to say for right now. It's currently 3.58 p.m. and we are expected to be at the Miami International Airport at 5.53. We have to drop off this rental car that we're in and then we will be checking in and heading to the lounges. So stay tuned. Day leaving out of Miami <laughs> is incredibly stressful or driving through Miami is incredibly is stressful. Absolutely insane. What did Siri just say? She said, keep right to merge left. I don't know. Girl, <laughs> yeah, what? Like that. <laughs> Anyways, hopefully we'll stay get in to the, the right lane. Soon. Stay in the right lane to merge left to keep right. I was like, dude. We're almost there <laughs> to drop off the car. Look at this. Stay it's in the crazy. second or third lane from the right. Pretty good if you ask me. See you in 12 and a half hours. See you in Turkey.
to the Istanbul airport for our 11 hour layover, which sounds crazy, but we're actually having a pretty good time. Pretty I have time. an espresso. I have had a lot of Turkish food. I think that's my third or fourth Turkish meal since I just, we've left. I just ate some suspicious meat. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know if it was raw or not. I guess we'll find out in a few hours. <laughs> and <laughs> and um, we didn't get too many clips in the Miami airport. We were quite rushed. We didn't have much time in the lounge because of Miami traffic, which is as to be expected. Um, but our first flight, our first leg was pretty smooth. Um, we got two meals and we accidentally ordered, like when we checked into our flight, we ordered the specialty meals. So we accidentally got this weird vegetarian meal, which was not so good. Sus. <laughs> um, but that's but that okay. was our own fault. Smooth flying, and everyone was super kind. And so we've been chilling in the Istanbul at IGA lounge. IGA lounge. We've been chilling here for a few hours. I have taken a shower, and I'll insert a little clip I took on my phone of the shower. It's quite nice. Next up, basically, we have another 11 and a half hour flight, leaving at 2:30 in the morning. 2:30 <laughs> Turkish time, which for our friends back in the United States, that's something, something. in the afternoon. <laughs> Five. No. Um, we're quite jet lagged. Seven, we're quite exhausted, p. but I did sleep kind of on the first leg, so I hope the same is true for the second. At the Istanbul airport, they also have, if you're a priority pass member or whatever, you have lounge access. They have little sleeping pods, but right now. We're in the lounge, sipping on some espresso and eating some interesting food. And we're heading to the sleep pods. This might be the coolest airport ever. They have museums in the airport. We finally made it to Bali, our first destination of our year of travel, and we couldn't be happier with how our travel days went. Although they were quite long, they were pretty smooth and they were pretty enjoyable. So after we spent 11 hours for our layover in Istanbul, we boarded our flight to Denpasar in Bali, and that flight was about 12-ish 12 hours. 12 hours. Yeah, yeah. 12 hours. It went by fast though. It did, we were able to get some sleep, we watched some movies on the plane, and then we landed in Bali at 
8.30 p.m. their time, which back at home for us, that's 7.30 a.m. And then once we got off the plane, we had to go through customs. We had to show them our COVID vaccination cards. So then we had to buy a visa on arrival, which ended up being about 35 US dollars. And then we went through customs. We got our visas stamped in our passports. And then we had to go to baggage claim. And thankfully, our bags made it through. And we have our bags in Bali. Um, little fun fact or fun tip we did put air tags in each of our luggage so when we flew to istanbul we tracked them and we were able to see that they made it to istanbul yes just in case that they got lost <laughs> which yeah. luckily didn't happen so we're prepared if they get lost but i don't want to say that a lot i don't want to manifest that yeah knock on wood right now you know hope for the best plan for the worst and so then we got our bags and we had to figure out how to download this app called Aralo, Aralo yeah. which we can download eSIM cards so we can use data here but keep our phone numbers from back in the States. Yeah. And that way we don't have to have like 20 plus phone numbers over the next year. So it works pretty good. Once we had all that set up, we set up a Grab account, which is the same thing as Uber essentially. So then we just ordered a Grab to our Airbnb and we made it here. Um, the Grab app actually was, uh, nicer than i expected uh for 14 bucks we um took a 50 minute ride all the way from the airport to changu where we're staying our airbnb host met us welcomed us in showed us our room and we're excited to just go out and explore and have our first full day in changu bali yes. tomorrow yeah that'll be great so we will see you guys then We're newbie vloggers. We don't know what we're doing. But we're gonna have a good time. We are gonna have a good time. Love you, mom, dad, grandma. And Grace. Me as well. And everyone else. Everybody else. Okay, cut that, because that's not fair to everybody else. That one curl, I gotta get a haircut.